Mom, are we rolling? Hit it, boss. Uh, we're rolling. That says we're. Oh yeah. Okay. Hello, welcome to Car Rides with Connor. The tie name is six forty six. We now we didn't exactly have time to grab breakfast, so we're just gonna pull through Duncan. Reason is we're out of coffee completely. I don't know how I let such a travesty happen to our family. No idea. So the world who hates us driving with open mugs should be happy today, cause look. No. Look, mom, no coffee. <laughs> Dude. <laughs> right. Let's take a look at daylight savings time. Look, ma, no brains. <laughs> She's actually one of the smartest. I'm, dogs just, I'm that kidding. We I'm have. just kidding. Well, I I thought it was funny. I know, but she's so. I mean, what freaks me out is how big could her brain possibly be? Like a walnut? Look at her head. Uh, Seriously, how big is a Pomeranian's brain? Uh, well, did, given the length of the skull, I'd say about that big. She's literally the brains of the operation in our house. No offense, Chewy. No offense. You're a sweet boy. <laughs> you just sit back. The haircut is a bit much, isn't it? Yeah. What I'm mad about is I let him cut his lion's tail. We always kept his tail like a lion. Yeah. I'm sorry, dude. Let's just try harder this time. Let's just keep on top of that yeah. hair. Anyway, it's Friday. Yeah. It is the birthday eve of the birthday eve of somebody I know. <laughs> That's not a thing, Mom. I'm making it a thing. Just like I made cheat streaming a thing, I'm making birthday Eve Eves a thing. <laughs> Mom, just because you can think something up doesn't mean it automatically becomes a reality. What? Just let me live my life. All right. And I'll let you live yours. All right, Rockstar. What are you going to get at Duncan today? Uh, just uh, a coffee. He had a, a chocolate frosted donut. Breakfast of champions. Yeah. Did you have anything else like protein yogurt? Like, nope. We're just going to be sugar and carbon our way through Friday morning. Yeah. All right. I can live dangerously. Yeah. Okay. Well, I'm on that hideous diet still. So <clears throat> can't, can't indulge with you. All right. Oh, is that too loud? I think. Shut the roof. We're supposed to get rain today, which bumps me out. Why is it beautiful all week and then it's time for the weekend and play and it's pouring rain? Life's just not fair. How about some subscriber time? All right. What, it, well, what do you thought? I know we didn't get to everything yesterday, so wherever you want to start, man, I just blew your phone up. Yeah, I There's, and I'm, that's not even scratching the surface. All right, Wayne Glass writes, I would love you to be a guest speaker at Columbia University. Like in New York? What would you guest speak about at Columbia? I don't know. Wow, Wayne. Do you, are you a student or a faculty? I don't know what we would talk about or he would talk about, but what would you talk about? I don't know. That's a very kind comment. Thank you, Wayne. Thank you, Wayne. I think Broadway and a keynote speak each in November's trip to New York enough. We love you, New York. Yeah. Okay. Fire away. John Evans writes, it's, hi, Connor. How did you react with the news of King Charles and Princess oh. Kate being unwell? Your oh. biggest fans in England, John and Leanne. Well... It's, it's sad is what it is. It's even more sad is that instead of banding together, the royal family is only becoming more divided. What do you mean? While the family is in turmoil, well, well, Harry's, I hear Harry's been cut out of the will. Well, you know what? They're people just like us, so. No loyalty among family, huh? Did I just go, go the wrong way? No, I didn't. Go figure. 
Well, there's loyalty in our family. Yeah. We're not going down like that. Well, are, are you worried about... There's this big thing, and is it like a joke or is it real that no one has really seen or heard from Kate Middleton? I don't know. And the Mother's Day picture thing is a scandal. I don't know. We don't know. We don't know. We don't get a lot of... get some news about it, but probably not like over in England. But the bottom line is <clears throat> we are concerned with them as other fellow human beings and want them to be okay. Yeah. And hope that they are. Right, Connor? Yeah. Okay, next one. Oh my gosh, lovely. Yeah, it's been a long, long month too. Hopefully it'll all calm down in April. I think it's fun having stuff to do. Yes, yeah, some stuff of, but not, not a lot. You know who you remind me of right now? Who? Eeyore. Mom, you say that like it's a bad thing. He doesn't seem like the happiest little donkey and he's always lost his tail. <sighs> now, well, one thing he does love, what? dandelions and well, then, flowers. Well, well, what? He, well, there's something. Mom, I understand you want, you want to help me. You want to help me get out more. more but I'm not like... That's... I'm do... But I... I also... Well, let's just say I don't enjoy my high active lifestyle. Okay. I, I heard. Heard, Chef. Alright, we're very two different people and I understand that. But I also know that as human beings, we are social creatures, pack animals. But but listen, there's a balance. There, your balance is different than my balance, which is cool. So the bottom line is, when you're when you've hit your threshold, you put your hand up and we sh shut her down. Yes, and give you the downtime you need, because yeah. you've got to recharge that social battery. I'm a firm believer in that. So we are going to just have our weekly Tuesday night meetings and figure out the game plan for the week ahead. Yeah. Has that been helping? Yeah. Good. That's all I'm here to do. I'm here to serve. It feels like I have a second job. I hear you on that. I don't enjoy it. I think it's fun because we're working together. Hey, Navajo, right? It's, hey, guys, I have a couple videos again. I asked a question a couple videos ago. Oh, Connor. Sorry. Do you like cooking and what's your favorite cuisine? I'm a 20-year-old autistic girl oh. from Idaho. Your videos bless me so much. Aww. Thank you. Thank you. And we love potatoes. Yep. Yeah, we do. And um, I think my favorite thing to make is pasta. So the answer is you do enjoy cooking. Yeah, yeah. And so you like pasta or Italian dishes. What else yeah. did you make? You made that wonderful Italian dish that time. What did you make? Um, you had your chef hat uh, pork on. Pork masala? Was, what was it? No, what was it pork masala? Maybe. You were at the stove. You had your spices out. You were singing music from The Godfather. I think I was making them. Was it a meat sauce, I think? I don't know. It was good. I don't know. But, but it always seems to be an Italian style. Yeah. I think French cuisine is really hard. Yeah. Pretty hard. But anyway, that's a great question. Thanks for asking that. Yeah, thank you very much. Any others? Those, some of them are like multiple comments on one if you get to those. Yeah, those. Like, those are cool. Um, you can just read it from top bottom. Love the videos. My Ooh. mom and I watch them every morning. Coco might be the cutest dog I've ever seen. <laughs> we think so, too. Yeah. And you too, two bucks. Question. Do you have a favorite story or memory with your dogs? Love from Nashville. 
What's her, what's that subscriber's name? Just like little. Uh, <coughs> Carrie is gains twenty five ninety six. Okay. Favorite memory with the dogs, huh? Favorite memory with the dogs. I have one for Chewy. So Ben was in eighth grade and he was kind of having a hard time and um, we surprised him with Chewy. And do you remember you guys came home from your dad's? Yeah. And I said, Ben, I just went to the grocery store. You need to go to the car. There's a carton of milk. I left the milk on the front seat and it wasn't the milk. And in the front seat in a little box was this baby nugget Shih Tzu. Chew back. Chewy. And Ben looked through the window and was like shocked and he goes, Is that is that for me? And then he scooped him up and the rest has been history. Right, Choo Choo Bugs? Yeah. I remember when when mom first brought Coco home. She was the cutest little puff ball I had ever she, seen. She literally looked like something we plucked out of the backyard. She looked like a woodland creature. Uh -huh. We should try to find puppy pictures. I wish I knew how, this is how bad I am with YouTube. You could like edit in a picture like right here. If we were, I yeah. was smart enough. Mm -hmm. You are smart enough. Mm -hmm. All right, so that's so me was presenting Chewy to Ben and then you liked it when little fluff butt nugget came home. Yeah. I think she's starting to sense where we're going. Yep. She's getting that crazy wily look in her eye. Yep. Any other questions or comments? Um. Um. Nope. That was it. That was all. Oh wait, hang on. Wait, sorry. Wait. Hang on. Oh. I thought I stacked us. Oh, you were asking me. Oh, sorry. But I'm sorry. I see where you were going with that. Love the shot. Issa Kirk, Kirk 16 writes, love the shot at... Oh, okay, move on to pass that one. You really need to control your temper and your manners. Noted. Noted. Here we go. Here comes Crazy Lady. Uh -huh. Love you guys. Wa love you guys. Is love watching you guys before bed. Sigh. At user dash... H O four K M two V B three V, whoever you are. <laughs> Thank you. All right, what you want? What kind of? Uh, we're here. We're gonna, I need to know your coffee order. All right. Okay, so just let's get let's, here. Uh, let's go. Now we're gonna try again this morning to be nice if someone pulls up behind us. Yeah. Hopefully we don't get uh, Mr. No. Nope, Tootcorn. All right, hold on. Okay. Good morning. How can I Good morning. Um, we would like a chocolate frosted donut. With, with a, without sprinkles. Without sprinkles, please. Um, uh, Hang on. A hot medium Americano with, with cream. Okay, sugar. Yes, please. A hot medium Americano with cream and sugar. And then I would like a large, and you have non-dairy creamers, correct? The oat milk? Yeah, we have oat milk and we have almond milk. What, are they flavored? Uh, the almond milk is sweet and it's vanilla flavored. But the oat mm -hmm. milk is sugar. Okay, I'm gonna get a large, hot almond milk coffee, please. Large hot coffee with almond milk. Yes, ma'am. And then I need two pup cups, please. All right. Anything else? Anything else you can think of? Um. Nope. That's it. No, I think we're good. Thank you. I think we're good. Okay. Cool. Where can I stick this thing? I just realized. Mm -hmm. All right. Now, so if someone comes up behind us, we're gonna try this again. Okay. But there's no guarantees. And it doesn't look like there's anybody pulling up. Do I get this weird feeling you, you would rather no one pull up behind us? Oh, someone did come. All right. Knuckles, I love doing. Don't you feel good about yourself? Yeah. Makes me feel good. Yeah. Okay. It's like a Daytona racetrack over here. Oh, gosh, she's going to get crazy on us. Good morning. Ooh, 10 miles one Daytona. Okay, I'm so sorry. 
whatever um, the person behind us, we like to do this. We like to get the food of the people behind us as well. Okay. So that's the donut. Yes. We have this and we have another one. Okay. So if you could just wait and we'll, we'll take care of theirs too. So we want to buy the person behind us too. Okay. Cool. And let's get some pup cups for these two, please. We still owe 512, but we have another one right here. And can we get we some have... pup cups for these two? Oh, she knows. She's going to. Thank you. And then this, um, mm. that, yeah, if you don't mind throwing that card away, that'd be great. Two. There's a not come through yet, but I'll let you know when it does and how much it is. Fantastic. Just keep a hold of that. Oh, she is going to jump in there. Okay, this is me. Thank you so much. And you have the pup cups, right? Yeah. Oh, my gosh. Girl and boy. Here we go. Here you go, Chewy. Oh, my gosh. All right. Fantastic. And then... And how much... Yeah, is that on my card? Do we have anything left or do we still owe you? Uh, 368 left. We owe 368. Connor? Huh? Let me, here. I'm so sorry. They're going to. Go, go. Let me just get my card. All right. Dumb. Hold on. Come on, Coco. Here we dumb, go. Dumb, good pup cup. Thank you. You have a wonderful weekend. Here you go. Oh, Koki. Num num. Good pup cup. Thank you. Have a good one. You too. Just tell them to pay it forward. What do you think, Connor? Yeah, You're going to get a nice little surprise. Yep. I love doing that. Just Wait, what about... Oh, yeah. Oh, my God. Oh, what? there's my coffee. coffee. I've got pup... Okay. Oh. We're going to have to... I'm having a pup cup disaster. Yeah. I just got them groomed. Sometimes I don't think. Yeah. <laughs> yep. Sometimes I just don't think. Did she get us napkins? Home well, girl. Well, we're going. It is a pup cup situation well, over here on the driver's side. Hey, Mom. I've yes, thinking, honey. Since we'll be doing a matinee show at two, that means we'll still have a day and a half. I'm to telling spend you, you're going to have a great weekend next weekend. You're just it's so many. Be, so many things. <laughs it's gonna be fun. Okay, trust me. Yep. When I'm in New York, one th thing that I like to do, shopping. All right, high roller. You can afford to shop in New York because I can't. <laughs> hey, listen to this. I follow this place on Instagram. Yes? It's called Urban Desserts. Yeah? You, you're going to have to watch their, their feed or their reels with me. No, literally, it looks like... The angels from heaven above came down and made dessert and started selling it in New York. Mm. And I don't know what kind of craziness they do, but like you, these desserts look amazing. They're like ice creamy looking. Yeah. And then you stick your spoon into it and all of a sudden fudge or caramel <laughs> comes out of the middle. Do you want to start mm. eating? Yeah. I don't know. And then Coco and I are covered in whipped cream. This is disgusting. Pop cups. Um, so there's that. So that part of my mission is what if we find this place and diet be damned? Because if I get to New York and see one of those, I try to, what I should probably think about getting something for Vicky, my coworker, Vicky. She's actually from New York. You're so you are so sweet. And if I can, I should probably take you with me to LA and get it signed by you know who no you lost me so vicky's from new york yeah and i want to get her a souvenir you want to get her a souvenir from new york how old is vicky you you're so oh, she's an elderly lady about oh grandma's age you two just have a little connection like you gave her a birthday card right mm -hmm. oh i need this coffee so bad good lord Okay, they sit on the throne of lies. This almond milk is not sweet. Mm. Is yours sweet? Yeah, it's a bit hot, but yeah, it is hot. I kind of like it. They used to have a warning on here, like, hey, the coffee's hot. 
Yeah, this is hot. Not, I mean, okay, so I need my stevia. This morning isn't starting off as planned. Mm. Coffee, we were out of at home. This, the other, it's a lot, man. It's a lot. Mm. Um, mm. So you want to get Vicky a souvenir mm -hmm. from New York. Yeah. It's really, what do you think you'd get her? What do you think she'd like? Coffee. Maybe a cap? A hat? Yeah, maybe. Speaking of hats, I have a new one on. <laughs> What's it say? House Tomlinson. A little sneak preview. Mm -hmm. We've got some fun new stuff coming. And I have a House Tomlinson shirt on. Yeah. It's quite cool. Mm -hmm. If I was in Harry Potter, I would hope that they would sort me into the House Tomlinson. With Mom, you. Hogwarts has only four houses. It's... Oh, this question comes up a lot. And, and a couple people have asked it. They want to know what house you've been sorted into. Slytherin. That shocks a lot of people. Here's oh, it's, you know, this is, no, here's the thing. Yeah, talk like, to everybody us. Everybody thinks the Slytherins, oh no, they're bad. Well, that's not entirely true. Did you know after the Harry Potter series, Harry's son, Albus Potter, becomes a Slytherin? Yeah, you And Harry was before. nothing but supportive. Whipped cream. She has whipped cream on her. She looks like she's having a fun Friday. Yep. What about you, Chew? Little tail. They had some fun Fridays. I'd like you to... Because oh. we're here. It's 7 8. Okay, we're at our usual time. Oh, yeah. We're actually early for ourselves. But, we're, um, we're right on dime. I think it's nice they gave you a box for the donut this time. Usually they throw it in a bag, which... You don't throw a frosted donut in a bag. Why? That that That's just sloppy work, in my opinion. Me too, because you get rid of frosting. Mm -hmm. Now that we're stopped, let's get some air. I love my... I love this moonroof. I, I don't think yeah. I can ever not have a car with a, with a, without a moonroof. Ooh. What about an... SC, what a what about a Mercedes SCL L moonroof all leather interior? Okay, Mister, I can afford to shop in New York and buy a Mercedes. Whoa, whoa, whoa hang on! I, I said gets... I could. I said I could shop in New York. I never said anything about buying a Mercedes. You seem to think I can. I could tip you upside down and shake you out for your milk money. So that's where the employees park over there, mm. on the side. Usually. I see a lot of them come this way. Oh, there's a couple now. Yep. I have a blinker on. There's nobody even here. Um, I wish I had some stevia for my coffee. Mm. I should have had her put it in. Wow, that donut looks good. Mm. I'm good. Mm. Oh, tap in there. Do you want help? Nope. Oh, just gotta dunk my coat, my donut. Here you go. Dunk in the donut. Um, did they give us napkins? I just feel like we're gonna need them. We didn't get napkins. How do you, how do you give us no napkins? Anyway, um, should we look, I, should we look at any more? What's the code again? Here, do your face. Uh, uh, let, let me, I'll do this while you eat. Oh, goodness. What is it again? Six, two, seven, nine, seven, nine. All right, there we go. Let's see. What else did we miss? Hi, Gabby from Louisiana again. She's, she's, Hi, Gabby. She's a good fan. Yeah. Connor and Lise, hi from Ireland. We've become addicted to your videos. Oh, that's so nice. Oh, Top of the morning to ya. Oh, it's St. Patrick's Day too. Oh, top of the morning to you, lads and lassies. This is J.M. J. Milburn, three, four, five. Yeah, sorry, mm -hmm. my glasses. Okay, which are so warm, funny, and comforting. Oh, well, here's a big warm hug from us. Mm -hmm. Can you hug them? Get in there. Okay. My late grandmother, God rest her soul, was yeah. actually Irish. County Kerry. Oh. Yeah. Okay, um, let's see. Connor has such a kind nature. Mm -hmm. And Lise, you're one of the best moms I've ever seen. Mm -hmm. Do you agree? Yeah. You're a sweetheart. 
I'd like to ask Connor about his reading habits. What genre do, does he like best? Mm -hmm. What genre? Usually sci-fi or fantasy adventure series. What are some of your favorite books and authors? I know you're gonna say Harry Potter. Harry Potter by J.K. Rowling, Lord of the Rings by J.R.R. Tolkien, and I haven't read it yet, but... Shoot. I think maybe A Song of Ice and Fire by George R.R. R. Martin. I just wish people could see, normally they get upset wearing open mugs, that the plastic top just popped off, spill, like, I, had I had my mug, this wouldn't, we wouldn't be in this boat. <laughs> okay, question for Connor. Do you want to work a different job in the future? I don't know, maybe, maybe someday when I've got enough money, I'll buy 200 acres of land and, and right by the water and spend my days as a wealthy farmer. A farmer, okay. Would you want to be promoted here at this job? Well, I've been working here four years now. Oh, so maybe. Okay. Okay, and it's just, just it. And then love the videos. They make my evenings filled with joy. I laughed when Lee said, swallow what's in your mouth. It's getting weird. And that's where I'm at with you right now. Okay, we got to go. You're, how, this is the longest one we've ever done. Okay, and here it is, 712. We should have been here, here. here well, we kind of have been here, sitting here eating. Yeah, well, we could have been, and then, yeah, well, I could have just gone inside. Well, I treasure the extra few moments we shared. Well, I, however, need to get to work on time. Well, that is anyway, a, thanks a for watching, guys. Be sure to leave a like, hit the subscribe button, and as always, stay classy, planet Earth. All right, say bye to your boy in the back. Do you need this hoodie? I guess not. Shoot, I wish we knew the temperature today. Here, I can, here. Why don't you take it just in case? Uh, my, my hands are full. Right, I'll help you. Look, I'm going to hold all this. You get organized. Cover that. This. Phone. Okay. Can't be without this. Yep. I don't have a ride scheduled for you, but we can see Ben or Jack are around. All right, thank you. Love you. Bye. Bye. Bye bye, Chewy. Bye bye, Cokie. There she goes. Oh, all right, all right, there you go. Bye bye, Cokie. Don't worry, we'll have our little guest house one day. I made this comment. I don't know, last weekend. And just said, you know, because I, I would love for Connor to have his own place and be as independent as he can. And I, I know he would want that and have his own space. I just think that realistically, that looks like something of a detached house or apartment that's sort of near to myself and my husband or maybe one of his siblings one day. And I really like where we live. So I was like, what if we got enough money one day and we could build a little guest house for you off the top of the driveway. And the reason I got that idea <clears throat> is our neighbors were super cool. They did it. So I don't want to talk much longer. This is a super long episode. Long story short, I made mention about doing a guest house. That's all he talks about. He talks about him and Coco having their own guest house and how they'll invite us over for tea and biscuits at 4 p.m. Anyway, it's really cute. All right, you guys, it's Friday. This was a super long episode. Thanks for everything. Thanks for commenting liking subscribing we love you we got new merch coming like a, just a whole new set of designs i think are fun but we just appreciate all your support even if it's just in watching with us we love you so much for it have a happy happy weekend 25th birthday on this guy we'll wrap up with you guys on monday and let you know how all the celebrations went thanks and have a great day